Well, I've been moving stuff around. Got me a little work here for those later this afternoon, but first things first. After so many years of not having no tunes, I've cleared me a little path back here. Trying to figure out what all them squirrels ate. We got to salvage this daggone stereo system. It costs way too much money to just throw away. Apparently, the squirrel has sharp teeth. If I catch that squirrel in here, you know, with their sharp knife-like teeth, I will no doubt shoot that damn thing and make a biscuit out of it. Keep messing with me, squirrel. Alright, I have spliced the top speaker wire, the bottom speaker wire. Now those two red and blacks there, I believe they called speakers. So that obviously is the power lines there going to the speakers. What I don't understand is uh, what this auxiliary is for. See those auxiliary cords there? I do not understand that. It looks like... Who knows what it is? I ain't got no idea. I guess you could plug in an auxiliary power. What does that say up underneath there? I'll check it out. I can bend down that far. Let's try to put the power to it. The power here, luckily, I chased it down. And uh, it seems to be okay. I'm hoping we can get sound out of this thing. Mr. Squirrel, we'll be under you right. Biscuit's coming up soon, I hope. <laughs> all right. There it is. Look at all those little splices. <laughs> it's time to turn it around and see what happens. This little uh, antenna runs over to here. It goes in there. It says FM antenna. This AM antenna is snipped. Let's turn it around and plug it in. See if we got power. I did it! It works! Yay! Yay! It works! It works! I ain't had music in the garage in damn in years. Alright, let's cram all this junk back in here. Uh, uh, oh, damn it. Uh, and do some uh, mechanic on those heads. You always got to have your heads just right. Y'all understand? You got to keep your heads turning, baby. Whoop, whoop. Ah. Been about an hour and it's still working. How you like that? All right, two heads. We need to tear them apart, take them apart piece by piece, clean them, grease them. I mean, because it only take right at two hundred dollars to replace them, and then thirty or forty dollars for a head. Holy moly! Let's try to save 200 and clean them. Yeah, after doing all this here, moving two motors out from there into the rear, I broke a sweat, man. I had to plug in that little uh, fan. Whoo! 
Let's go, 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 go. Clean some heads.